Hello and welcome back to Dial H for Hero Clips. I'm Calderness, and today we're taking a look at the second pizza box here, ladies and gentlemen. We had Hulk and She-Hulk on the first day. Today, let's see, which pizza do we unbox? I think we're gonna do the Groot box today. So, although Groot flavored pizza sounds a little weird, let's crack into this one and add them to our pizza party. All right. Full disclosure, I got to about this point in the last video and the mics died. So the cards are just out of their plastic. These are out of the plastic. Um, yeah, <laughs> I was like, oh no. So I had to recharge the mics and then we're back and we're rolling. So we get a pizza token just like last time. And ooh, this little Baby Groot bystander is really interesting. Now these aren't final print, so I don't totally know what this damage power does on Baby Groot, but a six speed, I believe that's flurry, at least it looks red to me. Uh, nine attack, 18 defense, toughness, three damage to the special. But the coolest thing about this baby Groot is he's 10 points and he has copyable Guardians of the Galaxy team ability. So 10 point Guardian is pretty dang cool. I really, really, really like that. So that's kind of fun. Let's take a look at baby Groot himself. He is, yeah, he's the guy. He's the main character. We'll look at Aua later, but for right now, we'll take a look at Baby Groot. He is 40 points, which means, oh yeah, that is right. He is shifting focus. He'll work with all the other Baby Groots. So free, if Baby Groot began your turn on the map, replace him with another character with this trait on the same click number. So he works with all your other shifting focus. So let's see how well he's going to be to add to your Baby Groot shifting focus kit, shall we? Searching in the dark, stealth. This is his special speed power. So, when a debris marker is placed within eight squares of Baby Groot, after resolutions, you may place Baby Groot in a square of that debris marker. Wow. Wow, like actually, holy smokes, just being able to plop him eight squares, shift to somebody else, move and attack, that's actually really good, right? Like that's really good if you can make that work. Okay, cool. His attack power on his last two clicks are dance off. Free, place an adjacent opposing character into any square adjacent to Baby Groot. Oh, I like that a lot, actually. This placement is really cool, kind of just moving them around you. I like that. Okay, that's really fun, actually. And you can, you know, obviously you can wait for him to get to those bottom clicks on a different shifting dial. Shift into this one. He also has outweight on those clicks. He got a good defense. Baby Groot has got great reducers, too, and invuln toughness. Okay. That's really cool, actually. I really like this dancing little, uh, little baby Groot here. The team-up card is team-up Iwua. If a friendly character with a listed name is on your starting force, baby Groot can use sidestep, and whenever he breaks away from an opposing character, he may generate and immediately pick up a pizza object. Wow, that's really good. Okay. So then he just now has sidestep the entire game. Obviously, he loses his shifting focus ability when he uses this, though. Scrounging for pizza is his new speed power. Stealth, once per turn, Baby Groot moves through a square of debris. He may generate a pizza object in that square. He's just making pizza all over the place. And then his attack power is food fight. When Baby Groot uses a pizza object during a terrain action and hits, after resolutions, he heal him three clicks. So if he's on click four, he'll heal all the way back up to full if he's hitting him with pizza. That, that's kind of awesome. I actually really like this. That's really thematic. That's really fun. Okay, cool. I like Baby Groot. That's fun. Let's look at Iwa, shall we? The little gooey alien pretending, pretending to be Groot. Let's see. What do they do? Cosmic monster, cosmic energy, perplex. This is, this is dance advice. Perplex when Iwa uses it to target a friendly character. After a solution, they move that character one square. That's pretty cool. He has 50 points. That's a lot. That is a lot, but man, perplex to just move someone one square is really good. No, it's step, step. I used to know how to pronounce purette, pur, 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 purette, perote. Uh, wow, all of my time in musical theater has failed me for what this is called. Oh my gosh, I feel terrible. Uh, but that gives him precision strike and quake. Oh, it's embarrassing. I love the triple target precision strike. The Quake, the Plasticity, Super Sense of Shape change on this piece to keep it locked down. Uh, his damage power on his last two clicks is Tentacle Form, which makes him a giant. And he has Shape Change from being tiny size. So yeah, he kind of gets like really big. That's his like true form. 
This is really fun. This is really cool. Four clicks of life, 50 points though. Interesting. What is his pizza team up? So his pizza team up works with Groot's, not necessarily something named Baby Groot, which is interesting. Uh, Perplex, when I would, uses it to target a friendly character. If a friendly character's name, oh, just contains Groot, that character may generate and pick up a pizza object. Okay. So he then perplexes and they just generate and pick up a pizza object. Many tentacles is his attack power on this one. So it's his entire dial. I will may hold up to four objects as long as they are all pizza objects. When I will hits, he may destroy any number of held pizza objects. Modify his damage plus one for each pizza object destroyed this way. So it's still only a max of plus three. But that means when he hits you top dial, you can hit for five damage if he is holding three pizza objects. And then, of course, it's still giant and shape change for the tentacle form back there. Wow. These are actually really fun. I really like the Baby Groot. I really like the Uwa. They're pretty cool. They are very, very pizza flavored. They're all about the food fight, having a pizza party. I like the idea of this pizza party set and how it's been developing. So let me know what you guys think of the Baby Group pizza party set, as well as maybe say what your favorite kind of pizza is in the comment section below. Mine is a stuffed crust meat lovers dipped in ranch, of course. Well, until tomorrow, guys, I hope you have a good one. We'll see you there. And for all things Hero Clicks, remember, dial H.